Yeah, happy movies, happy new year. And speaking of happy, I know one thing that definitely makes us happy. Happy enough to scream right now. I used to do a dance, I used to do a jingle. You ready with this one? All right. I scream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. I scream, you scream, we all scream for nice cream. <laughs> yes, nice cream is a thing, all right? It's not just a fun jewel. It's something you can put in your body and the main component is banana. And to give it that creaminess we all love, we're using Clover Authentic Cos Plain Yogurt. Now, the only authentic Greek-style yogurt in South Africa. And yet to show us how we do this delicious, happy-making meal. Is Chef Chumi in the building? Choo, 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 choo. No, I'm also in that. Uh, you all see the dude. <laughs> Ice cream! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Let's make some nice cream. Yes. Nice cream starts off with a base of... Okay, let me give you guys a tip. Whenever you're blending anything, I don't yeah. know if anyone has ever mentioned this before, whenever you're blending anything, make sure that the item that's closest to the blades is the liquid, because you don't want to start dry then... Like, I've the done that mistake so many okay. times, and then you just get like all the liquid on top, and then it's like this... Sitting there, mm, doing nothing. Stuck. Ah. Yeah, so start with the solids. Make a sure sneaky that little young culinary exactly. conundrum solved over there. Nice. <laughs> that actually helps you with blending your items. That's why okay. you don't end up doing that thing where you take it out and you put it yes. back. Avoid yes. that, avoid okay. that. So Makes we're going to start with our bananas. We semi-frozen them, that's just to help with once we put it into the freezer, it all cool. goes together. And we literally are making this ice cream. We're making scratch, it. Right? We're not like adding ice cream to ingredients. No, not at all. This is awesome. I think everybody wants to know how to make ice cream. All right, so we started with our bananas and we've also added some maple syrup. You could also Ooh, nice. add honey, you yeah. could add agave syrup, whatever that works for you. You could even make a sugar syrup where you just dissolve the sugar in some water oh, and then add that for additional sweetness. And then in here goes about a cup of our Authenticos. Uh, I'm going to add as much as I possibly can. Because it's also semi-frozen, I'm yeah. going to add a little bit more so that it actually blends together. The best part is that once it's in the freezer anyway, if you do see nice. that it's forming those icicles, just take it out, stir it a bit, okay. and then keep doing that. Another thing about Authenticos, I absolutely love it. The fact that we've got a great opportunity to use it in various ingredients. And yep. also the fact that it's got many flavors, right? Now, they're available in a 750 gram range. And the flavors come in coconut and apple and cinnamon. And today, we are going to be making use of the plain flavor because yeah. we're adding all the good stuff Correct. back into this, okay? Yes. Yes. So, step one, blend it up. Blend right? it all up. It already looks like something that I can enjoy. Just yeah. as it is already. I mean, Sweet. we've got some good vitamins and minerals in there. We've got some good macro balances. So this is like another meal on its own already and it hasn't even become an ice cream. And imagine putting some oats into this and like leaving your overnight Ooh, oats. That's another there step we go. together, you know? <laughs> so this goes into the freezer and this can chill overnight. If you want it to be somewhat like a, you know, like a smoothie bowl, you could also do that. Put it in the fridge Ooh, for like two nice. hours, take it out once it's firm, okay. add all of your toppings there where you can add some muesli, some fresh fruit. It's completely yes. up to you. But we want ice cream though. So we how do we get it to an ice cream form? This goes into the fridge. It can all set right. overnight. You can do that like right now. If you want to, if you wanted to, you mentioned, um, um, Ryle, that you could use a whole lot of different ingredients. I mean, we chose to use bananas today. You could use your berries, you could use your fruits, you could use nectarines. It's completely up to you what you choose to use. And then, me, this fridge is insane. I know. You just, it's like a time machine. <laughs> Overnight. Look, <laughs> Look at, at that. that. <laughs> Miracles do happen in the espresso kitchen. So okay. after night, basically, we'll end up with something like this. Correct. It's, it's ice creamy, set. it's icy, it's got all those textures. It's nice. And we can kind of just roll it up into a ball yeah, and get so going. What's the next step? Now. We've got our, the very, one of the most important things as well whenever you're scooping ice cream, make sure to go with a nice hot scoop. Because if your ice cream scoop is hot, it's uh, cold, it's not going to help you scoop Ooh, easily. that's smart. So make sure it's nice and, uh, and, and um, hot. And then and it's then... so easy to just create that ball like you've just done. Yeah, very nice. And when the fun nice. times begin, you can decorate your ice cream cone. I'm going to set it like that. Okay. And then you can decorate it. You've got some nuts. Okay. You can actually chop up some nuts there and you can do it. Nice, we've got some cashews here, right? We've got some cashews right. there. I'm gonna go all Master Chefy here and, and, and show you why I am the chef that I am. Why you decorate. are who you are, the esteemed, the only one chef to me, the award winner you know? herself. Yeah, yeah. So you could even put, if you wanted to, inside the actual blender, you could put some of these ingredients that we've put in there as well to give the texture. Or as you're layering it up in the ice cream, in the loaf tin, you can put your nice cream first, uh, add all these ingredients, okay, get the I texture. Like that. It's completely up to you, but just hey, do look, your thing. And look how add. good this looks. I, I reckon we could sell this. We should put this online, highest bidder wins. What do you think we'll get for it? Ryle's nice cream services. I like that. <laughs> I like that.
<laughs> I like that. Let's do it. I love this. And it's something that the whole family can get involved in as yeah. well. I know not everybody's back at school. I know some people are still enjoying the last few days. So maybe you can make the most of the opportunity that you have. Have some fun in the kitchen with moms or dads or pops or the whole family. And get your nice cream on it. It's got some good ingredients in it as well. So it's not as unhealthy as you think. It's got vitamins, minerals, the macro balance is there. And you can get all the recipe ingredients on expressoshow.com. Chef Jimmy, well done. Well played. Thank you. <laughs> Ooh, scream, you scream. We all scream for nice cream. There is <laughs> a classic mayonnaise that brings out the traditional French in three levels of tanginess. The mild classic, the medium classic, the strong classic. Tangy, the way you love it. Made with love by Clover.